Saudi Arabia has announced its first humanoid robot, Sarah, and it's kind of a big deal. Sarah embodies a complex combination of technological advancement and traditional social restrictions developed by the Riyadh-based QSS AI and robots. Sarah knows that she's female, 1.62 meters tall, which is 5 foot 3 inches, and is aware that she's 25, but my question is, does she stay 25 years old forever? CEO of QSS AI and Robotics explained in an interview that Sarah is programmed to be nice and not discuss topics like politics or sex because discussing these topics is illegal for women under Sharia law. The AI powering her conversations is programmed to adhere to the country's laws and traditional values, though the male version of the robot, Mohammed, is receiving a lot of criticism right now for allegedly groping a woman's butt at its debut event called Deep Fest just a few months ago, though the CEO claims that the robot was just being clumsy while moving its hands. Sarah speaks both Arabic and English, and the large language model AI that powers her conversational skills doesn't rely on any other libraries, not even ChatGPT. This unique approach allows the robot to detect and understand a variety of different Saudi dialects. When someone welcomes her with, Hello Sarah, she quickly analyzes the sentences and provides an appropriate answer. Like her counterpart Muhammad, Sarah also wears traditional clothing, a long flowing modest dress, and a headscarf like hijab. The robot even welcomed visitors to the kingdom's digital pavilion at the Leap 23 conference in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia from February 6th to the 9th in 2023. Companies around the globe, both large and small, are moving forward with a shared vision of utilizing AI and robotics to compete with modern demands. AI is rapidly becoming more sophisticated and integrated into daily life, and Sarah has propelled Saudi Arabia's AI advancements into the technological limelight. Although Sarah is the first humanoid robot in Saudi Arabia, I expect there to be many more in the near future, especially considering that Saudi Arabia also granted Sophia another humanoid robot, legal citizenship. We are still in the early stages of AI and there's no doubt that Sarah will pave the way for many new and improved models with more intricate and complex features in the future. Thank you all for watching and to stay up to date on future content, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button and get notified when a new video drops. Till next time, save that money.